short video, I want to talk about a very simple topic, auger pitch, and uh, what it means to the ice fishermen. Uh, the term pitch is thrown around a lot, and very often it gets used incorrectly. Pitch is simply the angle that blades are attached to the bottom of a drill assembly. It doesn't matter if it's a chipper or a shaver. Manufacturers have set that angle very precisely because it gets the most out of those cutting blades. Uh, you change that pitch and you change the attack angle of the blades on the ice and what you see is an auger will go from just a very fast cutting machine to one that performs very poorly despite the fact that the blades look razor sharp. So taking care of that pitch is of paramount importance. When an ice angler gets a new auger, one of the first things I suggest you do is Take a look at the bolts that hold the blades to the bottom of the drill. Every once in a while, you'll get even a brand new drill, and uh, those blades won't be perfectly tight. Make sure they're tightened down. And then, as you use that auger, every month or two throughout the ice fishing season, give those bolts a check. They do work loose. So that's one of the more common ways that uh, auger pitch can be changed. The other is through angler abuse of their own equipment. Uh, anytime you see somebody out there uh, using an auger, they start to drill the hole and it's not cutting, it's not biting right away, and they pick it up and they slam it up and down on the ice. Sure, you're fixing that short-term problem of having a little ice buildup, but what you're doing is you're creating a long-term issue. Every time you slam that auger down, you're making small micro adjustments to auger pitch, and over time, that's gonna dramatically affect the cutting speed and of course the enjoyment that you're gonna have using your auger. So check those bolts, make sure you're using your auger like the precision piece of equipment it is. Don't use it like a hammer out there on the ice and you're gonna get years of dependable service.